It's a familiar tale in many towns. Once Grand Movie Palace falls out of vogue and into disrepair, the former community theater in Morristown, now the Mayo Performing Arts Center, begins with that story, but its successful restoration makes it a laudable example of a revitalized venue. That's according to a group that knows. The League of Historic American Theaters named Mayo Pack its 2016 Outstanding Historic Theater. The Mayo stood out with our panel of judges as uh, just doing a great job, not only with preserving that beautiful building, but its connection and outreach to the community of Morristown in northern New Jersey. Restoring this almost 80-year-old theater was a passion project of volunteers in the early 90s. Chief among them was Bud Mayo. He's the man behind the name Mayo Pack. When he heard a group was trying to buy the theater and reopen it, Mayo wanted to help. But what was once a Morristown hotspot was in rough shape. Mushrooms growing in the aisle, seats that were barely usable, uh, paint peeling off every part of the place. Deciding to restore the historic theater was only the beginning of a lengthy process with no clear blueprint. Well, it's very difficult because oftentimes it's easier to make the case to tear it down and start over. Um, but uh, what we found time and time again is if you can be true to the historic space, you're actually going to be more successful. That's why the League of Historic American Theaters is available to organizations like the Mayo to be a resource for everything from remediating lead paint and asbestos to conducting feasibility studies. You really need to know that it's a building valued within your community and that the community, once it's opened, is going to continue to support it. Mayo PAC President and CEO Allison Lorena says that community support for the the venue has made the space sustainable. Partnering with the community and the community being behind, you know, the, the renovation and all that we do to upgrade this facility and to make the capital improvements really has meant a lot for this organization. It really has. Those capital improvements have allowed the 1937 theater to be able to host big time acts from Broadway tours to major dance companies and concerts. It was certainly scary to make the next jump in uh, to the, to the next level of performance, so to speak, in terms of paying them what it would cost to bring them here to the theater. And people came in droves to see, see the act so that we just felt more and more comfortable to continue to provide that level of performer here to Marstown. Lorena says there's been a positive economic impact on the town, too. We drive over $15 million of revenue back into the local economy, and we're very, very proud to do that. Lorena is also very proud to bring back the award for Outstanding Historic Theater on behalf of everyone who has made Mayo Pack what it is over the last eight decades. And, she says, for those still to come who will help keep it a part of this community. In Morristown, I'm Natty Orton, NJTV News.